This week for our Frozen in Time series, we visited the oldest building on the campus of St. Cloud State University. Lawrence Hall has had a presence in central Minnesota since 1885 when it first opened as a dormitory for women students. The original building was called the Ladies' Home until it was destroyed by a fire in 1905. The building was reconstructed later that year with the name that we know today. Legislature put out uh, $50,000 and they built the building that you're looking at behind us. Clarence Johnston came back as architect and it was called, instead of a ladies' home, it was called uh, Lawrence Hall. Isabel Lawrence was a very well-known uh, woman that taught here from 1874 to 1921. Later in its history, the building was retired in 1974 and was nearly torn down. However, in 2002, new renovations took place, giving the building its current look. Former St. Cloud State University professor William Morgan says one of the cool features of the building is that it's actually designed to be symmetrical. If you draw a line through the center of this building, from the top of the cupola down through the between those two doors, everything to the left matches everything to the right. The building is now home to 100 students, many of them international students. Every room in Lawrence pairs an international and a domestic student. The building also remains a historic gem on the campus of St. Cloud State University. I think people appreciate architecture without having to know a lot about it. You know, they don't have to know this is Georgian. You look at it and say, boy, this is pretty nice. I'd like to be a student here and, and, or a faculty member. Reporting from St. Cloud State University, I'm Dan DeBond, WJON News.